You know, my name is Mr. Ahmed. I'm, I'm John Ahmed. I'm one of the diasporas. I learned for the cooking about since 19, uh, 1999 in, in England. Basically, the reason I learned it, there's not a lot of Somalian I learned it for the cooking. The only reason I learned it, it was a, you know, I was a curiosity. I've seen it for the international foodies, you know, I've seen a lot of different things. So I decided one day to be, why not you can appear at one of the Somalian cooks and everyone see, you know, for the cooking. And once at a time I went for the competition, the audience of, uh, for Islamic world. So it was Sudan, Somalia, and Turkey, and Pakistan, Asia, a lot of uh, Islamic world. The basically what happened is I come, one of them, face to face for the Turkey. I think he's saying, oh, Somalia, no one else is Somalian, so, you know, they can't cook it. And they don't know their, you know, no one else's culture. So basically, well, I've been one of the success, you know, and that is, you know, I become, you know, I feel like a bit more proud to the nation, Somalian nations. One is a time, the London is a big city. You can get everyone of, uh, in the world, you know, you see a Chinese restaurant, tea, uh, Caribbeanese, and you can see for, you know, any, any nation in there. But there's not Somalians. It's not means like a welcome. So I decided to open a restaurant tea, to advertising, to make them where everyone welcome, your whole nation is to introduce the culture the background is what are they, the Somalians, where they come from, what kind of food they eat. When I success in that, and I encourage my community to make them everyone welcome in London. I passed it to America, I passed it to everyone, everyone was talking. So what happened is we have a TV, Universal, Royals. So and then I decided to encourage the youngest one to follow my step, to, to learn how to cook it to pass messages to the community. And we only you know, eat one dish every day. We don't eat vegetables, we don't eat most of the fish, we don't eat chicken, the most of them. So that's the only reason I was a curiosity to be a cook. And I graduated in West Midland in UK, in Birmingham. I worked in different places. One is a time then again, I decided to come to Somalia in Mogadishu. So that is why I became to open it in a casino. You know, somewhere the people coming in because it's a, the place of a war. You can't get it somewhere, you can go off to eat it. The first one I come in, I was surprised. So I decided to stick in the, my own country. Instead, I kind of go for Kenya, Nairobi, Pampasa, uh, Dubai. So I say, no, this is your place. You have to teach your people where to go to eat, where to, to enjoy, and that's why they are still here. So the few of you, they know see, you've seen it, my places. And I passed it to Mogadishu now. So now I went to the Jazeera. Jazeera I built up in a hotel, a small hotel, to see everyone, to enjoy it for the travel, for the tourism. Yeah? Even if it's someone else outside, not Somalians, they come. So we have a place we can take it while we're going to build it again, our country. So that's why I opened it. I decided to build it in a hotel in Jazeera. No one, no zone to go in there. There's a few of them, you, you know, it's harder to pass it in a Medina to go all the way to 17 miles from there. So now we have a hotel in there. My dream is, is to pass messages for everyone in the world The Somalia is getting improving. Improving of a beast, improving of a building, improving of a educated, the youngest one. It's been fighting, it's been, you know, lost on a time without nowhere. So we're hoping, we're willing, and we've done it. Just a short time we have it, and we're gonna reach it. If we decided to think it's work, 
it's going to work it. So guys, the, what I learned for the cooking, it's not something for Somalian man. It's, they always say, oh, I'm going to go to university to learn it for the cooking. The cooking, you know, you can cook it yourself. You know what, you're going to eat it. So put it in your mind, the cooking is a good subject to learn. And the food, there is where you can go everywhere and you can get the job. Yeah? Not only you say, oh, I'm going to go for the cooking, you know, or, it's not a good job. You know how much money you own it? Yeah? You know, how much money you own it if you be a chef and you can present it? The food is a design. It's like artist. You know, it's like a creative. The doctor is learning a part of the food. So remember for that. Put in your mind to learn for cooking. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.